Today I'm opening the most expensive crystal advent calendar that I could find online. I already opened a few cheap ones that were questionable, to put it nicely, and that experience made me wonder if a more expensive calendar might actually be worth it. I scoured the internet and eventually decided to buy this one for $300 on Etsy. I bought the biggest box with a full 24 days of crystals in it. The description said that every day would include multiple pieces guaranteed and that there would be at least two statement pieces in here as well. So my expectations are high. It also said that you could leave a note with your crystal preferences. So I wrote, I love the mushrooms in the pictures. I would prefer more unusual slash less common crystals if possible, because I already have a big collection of the basics. I'm a fan of weird jaspers and agates. Anything kind of funky is good. I did not let the seller know that I would be opening this on camera or that I have a YouTube channel, etc. This is not sponsored and I paid for this with my own hard earned money. So with that said, let's open this thing. Right on top we have a note. Thank you so much for your order. I had a blast putting this together and I hope you have a great time opening it. Enjoy Sarah. This is their Etsy store, Autumn Eclipse Jewelry. Now I finally get to open it. I've had this thing sitting in my house for a month now and it has taken all of my restraint to wait to open this on camera. Ooh, so much stuff in here. All right, I got our first 10 lined up here. This is day number one. Some of these are really heavy. I was about to say this feels like Christmas, but um, that's kind of the whole point. Oh, good. I thought everything was going to be labeled, but I wasn't sure. And as good as I am at guessing, sometimes it's nice to just know. And then everybody in the comments can't yell at me when I get it wrong. <laughs> okay, we've got three in this one. I'm going to open the big one first. It's one of the mushrooms. That is beautiful. Big, green, curvaceous. I'm in love. You can hardly see this. Hold on a minute. Okay, there we go. Hopefully you guys can see slightly better now. Please ignore how beat up my Ikea desk is. Now you can get a nice close-up look at how beautiful this is. Love that. Okay. It's another mushroom. This is gorgeous. I love the colors. Number three, another mushroom. This one's more of a bluish green. So pretty. So the fact that day one had mushrooms in it tells me that the seller probably did actually read my, my little preferences note. Very, very cute. I think this one is supposed to be ocean jasper. This one is Caribbean calcite. And the third one is grape agate, which is a little confusing to me. Grape agate looks kind of grape. This one to me looks more like more ocean jasper. Let me know what you guys think. Got our little family of mushrooms in the corner here. Okay, number two. This one is a little bit heavier. Let's see what we get. Ooh, oh my gosh, this one is so cool. That is so neat. Look at that. I love that. This to me definitely falls into the funky category. Very nice. It's also like my favorite colors, which is green and rusty orange. This one feels like a cube, which is very intriguing to me. I don't think I have any cubes in my collection. Whoa, I was correct. That is a cube, quite the impressive cube. Oh, it's so cool. I apologize in advance for how many times I say that is so cool in this video. It is, it's so cool. <laughs> Okay, what do these tags say? I believe this is the Indigo Gabbro, and this one says Carnelian and Moss Agate. That one sounds about right too. Day three. I just saw a sneak peek. One of these said Mukite. Three things for day number three. It's another mushroom. Oh my goodness, I'm in love. Oh, look at that side. It's so good. It's, it's so good. Join your family of mushrooms. This one is a sphere, I can tell you that much. And I love spheres. I don't have that many in my collection because they're so expensive. My goodness. Please focus camera because look at this. Are those little fossils in there? What is this? It looks like an abstract painting. That is so, so gorgeous. That might actually be my favorite so far. This one also qualifies as funky in my opinion. And number three of day three. Here's the Mukite pretty tower. I love it. It's gorgeous. All of these so far are ones that I would have bought. If I saw them in a store and they were a good price, I would have bought them. And I'm usually fairly picky with crystals. We got the Mukite, which is this one. Brecated Jasper. Is this it? Huh. I'm going to have to look that one up. And this one just says agate. Oh, mushroom down. Day number four. 
If I wasn't opening this on camera, I think I would have actually done it one day at a time because this is a lot at once. I don't know how long this video is gonna be, probably too long, but you know what? It's worth it. Four for day four. Woo, jeez. Well, there we go, I didn't break it. Another one that's so pretty, what is this? Holy crap, that is crazy. Look at that pattern. It almost looks a little bit like Mexican lace. I think this is a teeny tiny mushroom, teeny tiny mushroom. I have a few little mushrooms like this one. I'm gonna have a whole army of mushrooms. I love that for me. Wait, there's two in here. Oh, is this um peach moonstone? I think so, let's see if I can get that. Oh, so pretty. I don't know if I have any of this. Think. I might. That looks like carnelian, pretty sure. And last one for day four. There's two in here too. <laughs> I think this is a uh, rutile quartz. Very nice. There's the next one. It looks the same as this. I'm actually not sure what it is. What do the cards say? Carnelian, rutilated quartz, and on the back it says chunky copper rutile. All right. Red banded agate sardonic spear that was this one peach moonstone i was right about that flashy mini palm mahogany obsidian oh yeah 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 i should have guessed cube and mushy <laughs> for mushroom that's so cute i'm gonna have to go faster otherwise i am never never gonna make it through we're on day five now feels like towers Oh, it is a double-ended amethyst. I love that. I don't have any of these. The double-ended ones, they have a special name. I don't remember the name. Another one, this one's bigger and in my opinion, prettier. It's not as purple, but I like the, the kind of smokiness of it. Gorgeous. And last one, another double-ended one. And it's green. Green banded calcite, AKA green onyx and fluorite. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so it's not amethyst, it's fluorite. All right, day six. This one's flat and kind of the shape of a butterfly. <gasps> it's a sphere and a little tiny guy. Let's do the tiny one first. Whoa, 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 hold up. My goodness, I was not prepared for that. It's flashy on both sides. No way. Oh my God, look at this. That is amazing. Prettiest labradorite. Wow, uh, yes. All right, next one. <laughs> oh, guys, it's another Labradorite. There's some of that flash. There it is. It's a little camera shy. Pretty, pretty. This is a big sphere. Love it. I'm gonna need to get more sphere stands. It's running away on me. I'm gonna put it over here where it can't escape. And then this one. Do we think it's more Labradorite? Place your bets. It is. And I was right about it being a butterfly. <gasps> Whoa, oh, it's a skull butterfly. I don't know if it's showing up on camera. I think you can see it. This is so cool, so cool. I'm officially obsessed with that. Card says they were all laboratory. So we've done six days. Feel like I need to check in real quick. So I've bought a lot of crystals in my time. I've spent way too much money on crystals. And in my experience, this right here is probably about $300 of crystals. Like this one alone, worth a lot of money. So I'd say this is probably about $300, which is what I paid for this box and I've only done six days. This is insane. I was not expecting this. I thought it was gonna be good. I did not think it was gonna be this good. Day seven. This one is really heavy. Do you see that through there? What do we think this is? I believe this is a carnelian. It is a very deep orange red with those crazy spots. Oh my goodness. It's not a sphere, it's like an oval. This one I think might be the same thing, but it's a sphere. Wait, 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 no, it is not a sphere. Don't know what that is. It's a free form, I know that much. Look at this. This is so funky, so funky. What do the cards say? Carnelian and Orca Agate. Oh, and this one is just Orca Agate. Number eight. This one is a little bit bigger, but it's much lighter. There's so many in here. This is a tower. Whoa. Oh, it's got a hole in it. I love the ones with holes. I love the imperfect ones. And it's like a sunburst. All of these have been so unique. Number two of day eight. What is this funky shape? I love that. Cool, cool. Number three. Oh, this is more of that um, mahogany obsidian. Nice tower. And what is this? It looks like coral. I'm trying to be careful with it. 
Look at this one. Look at this one. It's sparkly. It's weird as hell. And I love it. I have no idea what this is. So fun. And it's big too. That's a big piece of whatever this is. Let's see. So we had rutilated quartz. Um, mahogany obsidian was that tower. We have carnelian and we have aragonite. Aragonite. I'm assuming this is the aragonite. My phone is recording so I can't Google at the moment, but I will look that up later. That's really cool. We have number nine. I was questioning the multiple pieces per day thing because that seemed a little bit too good to be true, but so far it's definitely true. I think it's appetite, but it has, um, that's not just my lights. It's like a, a, it has shimmer. It's gorgeous. It's so pretty. And it's another pretty heavy, decent sized sphere. This is ridiculous. I'm being so spoiled. It's the best $300 I've ever spent in my life. It's a little egg. I think it's a moss agate with an emphasis on the moss. And number three, another moss agate or green tree agate. Pretty little palm stone. So, so, so pretty. Appetite. Did I say that? Because that was my guess. Moss agate and tree agate. And number 10 is very heavy. Let's see what's inside here. This one feels like it has two things inside of it maybe. And this one feels really weird. It's a different shape. A skull or something like that? That would be amazing. Oh wait, no, I think it's a mushroom. Building my mushroom army. It's a little bit bigger than that first one. Now, number two. Oh my God, it's a brain. I've never seen a carved crystal brain before. That is crazy. It's a brain. What the heck? That's a conversation piece right there. Polychrome Jasper was this one, which sounds about right. I've tumbled some polychrome that looked like that. And the brain is red vein jasper. That was days one through 10. I actually need to make some room here because we're running out already. This is insane. This is ridiculous. This is so good. Oops. Okay, clean slate number 11. We got four. Oh, a leaf. That's so cute. I have hardly any carved crystals. So that's a fun little thing I can add to my collection. I also got these stands for flat ones like this to display them better. Here's number two. Look at that pattern. Very nice, very nice. Number three. This one's an egg with a fat butt. Adorable. Number four. I believe that's another carnelian. It's got a lot of little rainbows in there. I'm not sure if you can see them. And I love the lines, so pretty. Oh, golden healer and crazy lace. I think that this is for this one. Yeah, now that I look at it, it's yeah, a dead giveaway for crazy lace. I don't know why I didn't realize that. I took a little break and I watched some of the footage that I just recorded and I realized that it was super laggy and a little bit blurry. Apparently my settings were wrong. Probably fixed it, I hope. So we're gonna just jump right back into it. Day 12. All right, folks. Uh, no, I, oh. I need to introduce you. Ah, sorry. I just wanted your hands in there. Ah, well, okay, here are my hands. Tweedle dee, tweedle dum. Go I've... ahead, introduce me. <laughs> oh, you having trouble getting a word in? I've called in backup. This is my husband. He's going to help me identify rocks, folks. We're going to open up rocks. It's going to be glorious. Now we're on to day 12. Unwrap Can I open it? it? Can I open it? Unwrap it. Oh, this is the one with like a, Feels like a, book. a plate. Feels like a book. How messy can I be with this? Um, Do I have to be gentle? Are there any soft rocks? I mean, you don't want to break them. Gentle, gentle. I make surgical cuts, madam. Oh my gosh, this is like an ogre. <laughs> It's got layers. They're very well packaged. Oh, you're going to speed this part up. Well, yeah. I kind of thought it would be faster if you helped, but... <laughs> just so far, this I'm is I'm trying fun. to be gentle with your stones. Okay, there's two things. Which one do you want first? Um, why don't we both open one? To make it... oh, oh my god. I choose this one. Oh, it's an agate slice. <gasps> oh, it's so pretty. Here's the other side. Look at Look that. Look at the druzy. Druzy, can you guys see the druzy? All right, what is it? It's an agate slab. I don't know which. I guess it's agate. Ooh, it dispels negativity. I might disappear soon. You might, you might. Okay, this is yours, right? You want to do one? <gasps> oh my God. Oh my God. That oh, was too loud. Oh, oh my God. Look at that frog. Look at it. This is, is my favorite thing in the whole world. This mm. is my new favorite thing. The card was right on based on your reaction. What is it? It's a frog. No, no, no. What's the rock? <laughs> What is your frog composed of? Uh, 
Actually, I have no idea. Is it some kind of jasper? It is Russian flower agate. Weird. Which gives you focus, confidence, and again, it dispels negativity. I'm not long for this world. Look at that. All right, folks, this was day 12. Oh, I'm in love. Day 12 was quite nice. I don't know if anything's going to beat the frog. Oh, you know what it is? This is the and the oh. frog lives on the pond. That's exactly what this is. <laughs> That's so cute. It's a display for the frog. Oh my gosh. Pretty cool. Very happy about that. Day about 13. Four by four by two. Oh, it's he's got some heft. He's giving dimensions. I'm an engineer. This dimensions is so interesting in comparison to how I was doing this by myself. This is a very different video all of a sudden. There are three to choose from. I'm going to open this one. Oh, okay, fine. She's going first. Hmm. It's a tower. A tower of some variety. Is it carnelian? Hmm. It's very orange. It is orange. In fact, all of the words are orange. It Ar inspires creativity, energy, and confidence. Oh. They should have called this Savannah. Oh. But your light is so bright. It shines. Orchid calcite? Ooh. I'm going to take the big one. Is it a sphere? It looks like a sphere. I can't tell you without my protractor. <laughs> oh wow. my god. Like what is ball. that? Let's see if I can get it to focus here. Wow. That's so pretty. I'm going to need so many spear stands. Oh my gosh. It's got a really nice band through it. It does. All right. So I don't have any guesses for this one. I don't know. Yellow. Yellow calcite. calcite. Okay. Inspires okay. self-confidence, hope, and healing. Okay. I know what this is. It's a rock. That's a very weird shape. Another <laughs> mushroom. It's so cute. More mushrooms for my army. Okay. There's a, there's a theme here and I should have guessed. Inspires amplification, motivation. Motivation and support. Aw, it's me. Ready to amp it you up. You are here for motivation and support after my, my technical difficulties. All right, folks. This was day 13. Beautiful. I should do it like this. Ow. 14. It's so hard <laughs> to tell before you unwrap it. Well, yeah, that's the point. It's a secret. <gasps> Oh no, day 13. <laughs> okay, wow, you just dive right in. You're taking forever. Sorry. I know what this is. So do I, because you got this wrong last time. It's bloodstone. It is bloodstone. Pretty. <laughs> oh, a skull! Oh my goodness. Look at that under jaw. I love skulls. I think I only have one or two, so I'm happy to add to my collection. The other two are something else, and I think you'll like this. Okay. You want the small one or the big one? Wait, why do you know all the secrets and I don't? Uh, you're the rock queen. You have to be able to guess, and so far you haven't got one of these right, except for this one. But that's because you got it wrong last time you studied. Ooh, ooh, what's this? Ooh, it's normal rock. <laughs> Could you just say it's a rock? It's rock. No, but it's rock shape. I mean, if you had to describe rock shape, that image would appear in my head. I'm going to open the other one before I make you guess what this is. Okay. Although you probably can. Do you have any guesses before I open the other one? It's red jasper mixed with something. Uh, I don't know if this is like a technical name that it has. Okay. So let me make sure. Oh, difficult. Wow, looks like a dinosaur egg. Wait, that looks like polychrome jasper. <laughs> Okay, people. She says polychrome jasper. Really looks like a dinosaur egg. She does know her stuff, folks. Polychrome, polychrome jasper. I Passion, creativity, and transformation. That's hmm. all you. You're a polychrome jasper, honey. Oh. Day 19 is the biggest one. So I'm very excited for 19. But is it the coolest one? I don't know. I don't know what's in it, but it's really big. Christmas Eve should be the coolest one. Oh my. This advent calendar is blowing my dang mind. I don't know if you understand how good this is because you're not really in the crystal buying world. Are you talking to me or the people? You. Oh, well. From everything that's in front of you right now, do you think this is worth $300? I don't know how much any of these are worth. A lot of money. I would have paid $300 for that frog. Look at the baby. Oh, there's tiny what ones. The okay, well, should we go smallest to largest? Yes, I want to open this. Ooh, it's a tiny it's a star. star. Yeah. Oh my Look at that. God, so tiny and cute. I would think it was an amethyst myself. Uh, le I'm gonna say it wrong again. Uh, in one of my videos, I called it Lepedia Light. Oh wow, you're real good. <laughs> it is Lepedia Light. <laughs> le <-pedio> Light. <laughs> <laughs> Soothing transition and balance. Uh, for all of you writing an angry comment right now, I know it's not pronounced like that. Do I know how it's actually pronounced? Lepidolite? No, not right now. L Lepidolite? Le Lepidolite? I think it's Lepidolite. I like Lepidolite. That's <laughs> that's what I'm calling it. Oh, look at that. It's, it's a, a rock marble? marble. It's a marble. Well, if you make a rock into a marble. Okay, it's, it's a, a tiny sphere. I'm going to try to focus here, but it's a bit hard. It's focusing on your calluses instead. Sorry, folks. Here, I'll get them out of the shot. <laughs> I'm guessing this is... Oh, wait. I'm not guessing. You're guessing. What do we think this is? Smoky Quartz. Mini Sphere. It is indeed Smoky Quartz. Ho, ho, ho. Grounding protection and strength. You're going to have so much strength after this. Are you going to do the next one? Oh, I think it's a mushroom. It's wow. another tiny mushroom. Oh, it's a little bigger. What's the one you've got? Uh, pink opal. Let me see. I'm going to try to give you a hint. It's close to a precious metal in name. You would know that. 
It's the precious metal responsible for white gold. AU. You're so close. Ro, ro, ro wait, ro, rhodiolite? Ro so close. Rhodonite. Rhodonite, okay. Grace, yeah, love, yeah, and yeah. purpose. Oh my gosh, so many in each day. I know. Our days something. are so full. This is insane. It's so much. This feels like an egg. Ooh. Interesting. Is this it is like moss agate? It looks like moss agate with but like Amazonite. It's got an infection. <laughs> Don't say that. What the heck is that? It looks like moss agate with like Amazonite in it. All right, well, this Very is a pretty. tumble. Uh, it's not the tumble lard. Tumble with some moss. It says with some moss agate. So it's actually something else. Okay. It is an agate. So what does it say on the paper? Transformation, comfort, and balance. The metaphysical properties are not helping me here. That's all they tell me. They don't give me most hardness or anything. It's flower oh, agate. Oh, interesting. I love flower agate. These are the love kind of flowers she wants on Valentine's Day. Pretty A much. A dozen rocks. <laughs> all right, two left. Let's Go open ahead. them at the same time. Same time? Okay. Wait, there's two in here, I think. Ooh. Ooh, the banding. Wow. You're probably gonna guess what this is. That is rose quartz. Oh, it's really pretty. It's got some rainbows in there. I have a few there rose quartz towers. I actually have like a little collection going. This is bigger than the ones I have. She is right. This is rose quartz for intuition. Oh, her intuition was on the money. Oh, that looks like rose quartz. The tumble version. Beautiful. Uh, and the other one, you have to give me a guess. It's got some bands. I know what it is, but I don't know. Is it just, <laughs> is it just um banded agate or something like that? Ah, ah. It's orangey white. Ooh, look at the bottom. Look at the bottom piece. People. Red banded agate. Aw, yes, indeed. 16. All right, we've got two. You going first? Let's see what we got here. Oh, this is a sphere too. I know what you want. I, I that keep one almost is saying spear. It's not a spear. It's a sphere. Can you guys see that? Gabbro. No, look, look at those. It's got some. I'm not sure because it looks like the other name, but you indigo said gabbro. It. Oh well, you know. Right. I'm hoping this is that one because there is indigo the only gabbro way, in this. The only way I know is because this is also indigo gabbro. Oh, cheater! The cube. Okay, I get to open up the colon. Wow. Ooh. I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see this. I'm going to try really hard. Oh. I think it's kind of washed out. I don't think it's, it's showing. It's kind of black as night. Yeah, but I can kind of, there you go. You get some of that sheen. This is gold obsidian. Oh, yeah. I, I was going to guess that. Of course you were after I tell you. I um had gold sheen obsidian bracelets in my in my shop. I mean, up close, this looks really. It's gorgeous up close. It's not really showing up on camera, I don't think, but it's, this is it's, hard it's gorgeous. To show up on camera. Day 17. Isn't he doing such a good job? Job, guys oh my there's so much in here i think like two towers or magic wands one could magic be a, wands one could be a spoon a s i would love i would love a crystal spoon as soon as i'm finished going on etsy finding crystal spoon <gasps> bumblebee jasper that's what i thought it looks like the sphere you got yeah on vacation yeah. so i'm gonna put this over here show the people oh it's so pretty it was in fact bumblebee jasper knowing what else is in here now mm -hmm. i'm really excited for this tell you what next one i will guess yes what they you're are. gonna have to start guessing i'm gonna have to start guessing if you right. want to be the rock king you're gonna have to live up to i don't want to be the rock king no nope. i didn't ask for the rock you've already gotten the title ah. rough stone rocks calls you the rock king so you are they don't call me the Oh, God. Oh, God. They have decided. All right, and... Ooh. We have two stones here. I'm going to pick up the first one. Let's see if I can... There's uh, that oh, nice shimmer. Oh, my God. It is indeed labradorite for people needing intuition, clarity, and balance. I'm very clumsy, Ow. so I could use Ooh, the balance. points are sharp. Let's see if I can get this one to shine for y'all. Moonstone. So pretty. I like the labradorite more. Oh, it's so pretty. It competes for the shimmer. Uh, they're nothing. both amazing. They're very sharp, though. I'm not going to pick favorites. Well... Well, maybe I will, but not at this stage in the game. I need to see all of my options. I know it's not in camera, but there is the most beautiful spread of crystals right out of frame. 18. 18 is kind of an awkward shape. Are you going to open it or play with it? I'm going to try not to look at the answers this time. Yes, don't look. We're going to see if I am any good at the rock guessing game. Uh, what I do that? Okay. What is going These on? These are not built for dexterity. Did it bite you? No, I dropped it and then I got scared I was gonna hurt it. <laughs> Hurt it? It's in bubble wrap. One of these is fragile. You're not gonna hurt it. Oh, one of these is fragile. <laughs> All right, uh, I'm gonna try to focus on this beautiful it's little, little mushroom. Looks like a type of selenite to me, or what color is it? Blue, white, make a milky blue, white, like aquamarine. There you go. Aquamarine. I got there, folks. I got there eventually. <laughs> ah, the 
number nine. Mushroom. Number nine. What are you, uh, you I, doing? I'm, what, number I'm mushroom? keeping a mushroom tally here. You have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I think that's nine. I think it's nine. I wrote in my note to the seller that I like mushrooms. And boy, <laughs> did she deliver. I like mushrooms. Give me more. I need all the mushrooms. I'm building a mushroom army. Ah, oh, well, here's number 10. <laughs> <laughs> Oh God, she choked on this mushroom. <laughs> I just breathed in so deeply and when I gasped. I'm just trying to get it to where my hand, you know, we don't want to focus on my callus. Oh, you're going to cover the calluses? <laughs> yeah. Um, it is pretty. Oh, you won't get this. I wouldn't have gotten this, so you, you won't white. get it. Mm, it's kind of milky in nature. What are we going to call this? Like a- Milky in nature. Like like, like a shadow on us or- uh, <laughs> Are you just coming up with names? Or uh, Aqua Durite. That sounds like a potato chip. Kiwi Jasper. Yeah. And look at the back. Mushy. Mushy. <laughs> Next. There are two in here. This looks like Mexican lace agate. Oh, so pretty. I feel like you've tumbled this before. It does look it like does, Mexican it lace looks, agate. Yes, it looks like Mexican lace. It doesn't have any of the red or orange, but I think that's what... Oh, wait. I have the answers in my hand. <laughs> yes, you do. What is it? Ooh. Oh. Sorry, guys. I really like that. It is nice and blue. Aqua Jasper. I feel like this is what she would call an I, amor. I think that's another aquamarine. It's kind of like the mushroom. It's just not as... It's a very similar blue. It could either be that or it could be celestite. Celestite. But it says raw for that one and that's not raw. I think it might be more aquamarine. But let's open the rest of them and then we'll figure it out. Whoa! Ooh, wow. That's beautiful. Oh, I'm having trouble with this one. No, that's the celestite. If this one we call druzy this is uh what we call this i wouldn't really consider that druzy that would be more like just like raw crystal to me groovy groovy, oh, groovy. look at all the grooves i oh <laughs> Groovy. Okay, I get it. I get it. I thought you meant like groovy, man. We've never figured out what this was. Was it? I mean, it looks like a banded lace something. There's one that says Caribbean calcite. calcite. What's it say on the back? It's, <laughs> it does say tumble. It says tumble. And yes. I guarantee you this is not a tumble. No, that's not a tumble. I know what it is because I, I saw a sneak peek. Oh, it's so pretty. Blue. I don't know. An amethagate? <laughs> amethagate. Amethystagate. Okay, that, sound, that sounded bad for a minute there. <laughs> It's got some green. It's got some clear. I'm not sure if you know this crystal. I don't know most of these crystals unless they're very common. We haven't talked about it and you can't really tumble it. So you, you don't. Hemolite. I mean, you can tumble it, but it it's hard. So I haven't done it before. I want to try it. Why is it hard? Because it's soft or because yes, it's hard? it's soft. Is it fluoride? It's like. How did you know? Because you have tons of fluoride. You won't. You're, you're too afraid to tumble. Oh my God. You listen. <laughs> so nice. <laughs> <laughs> this is so pretty. I love this. That's a massive. I love this. It is. It can hold all your, your marble. <gasps> it's a marble holder. It is. Guess what? We made it to 19. Okay. What's so special about 19 it's other than the giant, fact that it looks like a taco? It's giant and heavy and it looks now like a taco. I want a taco. You have to admit it's heavy. It's heavy. It's heavy. And it's right. really big. I don't like guessing because I'm bad at guessing these things. You were actually, you did great. You you remembered fluorite, which I, I, I'm very I remember everything about. I'm told eventually. I just don't always unless I to say it to you that. in the hour before you fall asleep. It's selective recollection. <laughs> you know, if you have selective hearing, I have selective recollection. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. All right, we have one, we have two, and we have answers. And we oh, this is just a giant one. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Oh gosh, hold on, I need more surgery. Ooh, they all look. Wait, I thought you said that you 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 looked at the the sheets. I did, but they they're all crystals. Ooh. I mean, they're all. <laughs> They're all towers, so I Look, don't know. I it's, love it. It's got some. No, oh, it's, it's a Druzy cave. Yeah, it's not broken. Ah, yeah, it's like a little cave. I, we're gonna have to open the rest before I can choose which is. Is which. there something that's like chocolate something? No, I'm guessing it is this one. Although I wouldn't have thought this is what it looked like okay. because you did tumble a lot of these. They were really, really cool. And you sold a lot of them too as tumbles and jewelry. Carnelian? You've been doing a lot of this in your journal recently. What? Handwriting. Fancy handwriting. Calligraphy stone? Ah, oh, damn it. I messed it all up. <laughs> no, it is calligraphy stone, but it's specifically something called Coquina Jasper. I, I don't think this is that. I think. We're going to leave that uh, here. Calligraphy stone looks very, very distinctive. I know. That's why I was like, eh, eh, but it's called that. And then in parentheses, it's calligraphy stone. So maybe it's um, mild no, calligraphy. No, no, no. That's just like another ah. name. Calligraphy stone has like 80 different names and that's one of them coquina i'm saying that wrong i'm sorry Ooh, oh my gosh wow that's smooth oh my gosh look at that oh that's so 
pretty. Jasper. What kind of Jasper? I would have almost said this This is what almost looked like that bloodstone originally, like the green yeah, and the red, it but does it's not kinda. the same kind of... Uh... I think it's some kind of Jasper. Uh, I mean, that's kind of a safe bet, but... Oh, it's actually a mix. It's two stones in one. I'm going to admit it. I saw, I saw it. It's carnelian and moss. Yeah, that makes sense if it's like a blend. See, the colors match the names. Color. I just realized that. We're on day 19. It took me that <laughs> long. I wasn't really reading the, the metaphysical stuff because I'm not really all that into it. Um, So I didn't notice that before. That's what I, I was I think you could use more of it. Oh, I'm yeah, saying. you think so? Just Some crystal healing? I'm doing this. It's a very hardest. interesting way to open this. <laughs> Oh, that's the calligraphy stone. Oh my God, that's a giant tower. Oh, they Holy had to crap. wax the tip. A lot of the time they do that. So the tip stays protected. <laughs> God, that's gigantic. I love it. Oh, I like this spot. It looks like a... Yeah, they're all little fossils. Oh, it's like a Where's Waldo. Find the comb. Oh, wait, can you guys see the comb? Oh my goodness. That is now the biggest tower I own. I mean, this is nice. But the other one says money, Jasper. Final results, folks. That's all the got. towers. I love them. I feel like I'm playing blackjack now. One, two, three. A three, a four. Ah. You're having trouble. Five, hold on. What? How can this pop? Four, five, six, seven. There are seven tags in this thing. And you're 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 showing your hand, babes. You need to look away <laughs> when I'm doing it. Did you see them all? I saw a couple. <laughs> Darn it! You still have to guess which is which. Oh, they're little babies. Oh, that's why there's so many. Okay, okay. They're little hearts. Oh my. Oh, I love them. Um, okay, this is howlite. Oh, jeez. Ah. Okay, hold on. She says it's howlite. I don't know any better, but there is in fact a howlite. Um, this is regular. Court. That's what I meant. It's a clear court answer. I love these. This is Rhodonite. Oh, got it. We've gotten one of these before, so we knew. <laughs> and this. Oh, ah! oh God. Okay. Oh, God. This is living up to its name. <laughs> I found it. <laughs> this is living up to its name. Oh. Uh, it's real cool. Crazy Lace. Crazy Lace Agate. Yes. Four little hearts. How's pizza sound? Pizza sounds amazing. Why would you do this to me? Why would you do this to me? Ooh. That looks like Selenite. I saw the card and it said Satin Spar. I thought it said Satan Spar. <laughs> <laughs> and then I got real excited. I was like, I want to see I don't what, think what, that's what it says. I want to see what Satan Spar looks like. But no, no, no. She's probably right. It is Satin Spar. Uh, but I really want to know what Satan Spar looks like And now. I'm almost positive Satin Spar and Selenite are like the same thing. Did, did you show the people? I did. I showed it right next to the sign. Oh, look It does at look that. very nice. I really would have thought Selenite. I'm like 90% sure it's the same thing. Or like that they're very closely. Two right. left. We've seen both of these. You know both of them. You'll, you should get both of them. Mm. Okay, I feel like you're cursing me by saying that. Oh, Ooh, that. it looks like it's not flower agate if that's what you think it is. That is what I thought it was, but there's only one other one in this thingy if it's not that. Uh, the color's in the name though. Purple. That's not purple. Pink, pink what? <laughs> Blank de France. What? What's the name of the famous bike race? Blank de France. <laughs> yeah. Tor, tor. Tor. Pink Tor. Tourmaline. Oh, yeah, duh. I was like, this looks so familiar. It's pink tourmaline. I have very odd ways of getting her there, folks, but <laughs> she always gets there. Pink tourmaline. So the last one. Oh, it's so pretty. Wow. Oh, my gosh. I'm going to try to show this to you, folks. Focus. I actually have a flower agate heart that looks kind of like that, but it's not nearly as pretty. Wow. Oh, my gosh. It's got some heft. That's is, so fact, pretty. These were all hearts. They are all this hearts. This was the heart day. I just put that together. Wow. <laughs> they all look, oh, look. Oh, the heart's Oh, my oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. We're running out of room because there's so many rocks. 21 is heavy, too. Always judging the package. That's how I do it. Feels like a rock. Feels like a rock, he says. This is a massive sphere. <gasps> oh. Oh, oh my god! Sorry, it was heavy. Sorry, sorry. I definitely don't want to break whatever that is. I feel like you want the giant one, so. Oh, yeah! <laughs> no, 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 no. Small one first. Okay, you just want to go. <laughs> Whoa! Ooh! That's nice. I always got a little druzy. Uh, okay, you know, we're gonna open the other one first because <laughs> I, I don't know what it is, and uh -huh. it doesn't say it on the thingy. It's so big. Whoa. Whoa. Ooh. Round. Oh, look at the little rainbow sparklies. Yeah, trying to go slow so it'll focus. Pretty. It's like Saturn. It, yeah, I was just about to say it looks like a planet. What is this? Okay, so I'm going to guess, but you will confirm based on the clear translucence, absence of one color. I'm pretty sure this one is the agate. 
Okay, what's the other option? It's gonna roll away. Blue Rose Quartz, which based on the blue, I thought this one could be. Yeah, okay. I'm actually not sure. I mean... I feel like Blue Rose Quartz would just be like a blue quartz. Because well, Rose Quartz is just pink quartz. I'm trying to figure out which one is the pink. Maybe that is? This one's more translucent, so I feel like I'm leaning towards this one as... Quartz? As the quartz. And this is the agate? That side looks agate -y. What do the people think? Let us, let us know in the comments. Yeah, vote in the comments. What you think, because I, I would love to know what this is. I, I'm... I'm leaning quartz. All right, you know what? This is huge. Oh, 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 oh. We're gonna move the stars now because you know what? This thing. No, 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 no. You're gonna, you're gonna break the floor. Right? Orb holder. It's just so it doesn't roll around, honey. Mm-hmm. Okay. Wait. Is it today, the twenty-second? No. Yes. All right. So this is today. Today's rocks. Today's rocks for a modern society. There's a lot of cool stuff in here. I want to open the tiny one. Please be careful. And don't whack things. I just, Whoa, it's I just, two, I think. I, I just smacked my microphone. Oh, they little mushrooms. Or is that another? Um, well, I almost I said uranium. Is. I think you've got it right. <laughs> it's not uranium. No, it's not uranium. <laughs> Uh, you know what I mean, though, right? Focus for the people. I'm trying absolutely not uranium. Um, what? It starts with a U. It does. What? And you flew these when you were a kid in the park with a long string. Unikite. Ah, yes. <laughs> See? Yes, I, I go with the tips. I have tumbled this before. Unicite so wait, this is mushroom number eleven. So many mushrooms. Perfectly clear. Yeah, it's it's an agate. I believe. Oh yeah. It says mini mushroom. Mini mushy. What is this? I'm trying to be careful because one of these I think is really delicate. Oh a little baby to add to my collection that's really pretty oh it's got a it's got a pocket uh it has a pocket i wouldn't call it a druzy more like an oozy an oozy it's an oozy pocket it's okay. pretty it's so cute and small correct it does say tumble i have i have this i have these i know wait i know what it is but i don't know what it is i know you'd call this a palm stone there are two beautiful lines running through it i was in a live sale and they had these and i went crazy and i bought like five of them because i love them that much oh okay i know what it is oh, i forget what it's called We've seen another one of these. It's almost color. like a moonstone. Mm -hmm. It's like a green moonstone. It's a green moonstone, folks. Look at how beautiful that thing is. Even though I already have five of these, I will happily add another to my collection because that's how much I love it. This has been like two hours plus of recording so far. So if I'm starting to get a little slap happy, that is why. Here we go. I knew this was the cool one. Oh, is it a mushroom? Oh. It's a mushroom! But look at how cool it is. Fluorite mushroom! Oh, immediately. Oh, nice it's so pretty. Pinks. Wait, why isn't the green showing up on camera? I hope you guys can see it. It has it is beautiful green and blue stripies. There we go. Did you just fart? <laughs> no! <laughs> it smells bad. It's not it's not the mushy. It's you. It's not me. It's you. Don't blame the mushy. You're making fun of me here. I'm gonna open this one. <laughs> Ooh, look at those colors. It's an abrupt, ooh. Ah, it has a cute little hole. Okay. I'm sorry for screaming. <laughs> There's a druzy. Holy crap, look at those colors. That one is so funky. Oh my God. Wow. I love the hole. It's all green in there. It's a druzy hole. As opposed to a jersey hole. <laughs> What is it? Oh God, I'm supposed to guess. Um, I have no. Take a look. I've never seen anything like that. Oh. Um, it provides happiness, healing, and protecting. That really does not help me. It's one of your favorite rocks. Jasper. Sure. And it comes from not the land, but the. The land down under. No. <laughs> if it's not on land, the it's sea? where. The sea. Wait, Close. ocean Jasper. Ah. Ocean yeah. Jasper. Ocean Jasper. Look how pretty. Okay, that Boom. that's one of my favorites. The vibrant colors. Yeah, nice. that's incredible. Up. Okay, two to go, folks. Day 23. Oh, 23 has a little bit of heft. 24 is supposed to be the big kahuna, right? I have a theory about what oh. 24 is. Okay. But we're going to wait until we it get there. It looks like a single giant rock. I think it is. But don't spoil it. I've held it in my hand, so I know. But, well, I think I know. I feel like I know what that is. I feel like you've gotten some of this and you haven't tumbled it yet. With, mm -hmm. like, snow flower. Um, you're thinking of Snowflake Obsidian, which has smaller white spots. I, I am, and according to this, it is not... Oh, I've never heard of this before. But it actually There's, looks a lot like the animal. You're not going to believe that I was just about to say this, but Orca Agate, I think, is what it is. Okay, we'll, we'll see. <laughs> It's actually a really nice slice. That's so cool. So let's see if I can get it for you folks. It's got like a translucent middle. Hop the other side. Looks like really good fancy cheese. It's making me kind of hungry. Or maybe it's just because you said pizza. You know, the bottom is what kind of really, in my opinion, gives away based on other things we've seen because we've gotten this rock for. Mm. 
flower, flower item. It is. Ha! She was right there. Beautiful. Oh, and it does sit very well. It does. It sits extremely well. Whoa! Whoa! Smoky white. Mm -hmm. It's kind of like a black and a blue. Mm -hmm. And then out of nowhere, there's a big cave. Oh, it's so good. I'm trying so to good. let the people see, but. It's so good. It's Christmas Eve. Oh, wait, no, that's not Christmas Eve. That's Christmas Eve Eve. Looks pretty good. And you know what? She already guessed it because I gave it away, but it is Orca Agate. I was guessing that before you said I know. that. I you know. can choose to believe me or not. I want to see how it sits. Not it's bad. beautiful. I love oh. it. You people have no idea how many shelves I'm going to have to hang for these. I was just about to say, I'm going to need another cabinet. Mm -hmm. I already have a whole crystal cabinet. I'm going to need another one. Okay. Only one left. We're almost there. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Look at this. This. Okay. What we do you think it is? We already can tell it's a giant sphere. <laughs> it contains your hopes and your dreams. It's Christmas Eve. I love spheres. Oh, sorry. It is number 24, folks. Yes. This is the last one. Ooh. This is the grand finale. So prepare yourself. Yeah. Sound like a murloc. You do. You're gonna like this. I think you like this one. Any giant sphere, I think I'll like. Is it a sphere? It most certainly is a sphere, but <gasps> it doesn't say that. I mean, it really looks like one, but it might not be one. <gasps> it's Kumbaba. <laughs> it is Kumbaba Jasper. Oh my god! How did they know? I literally did not tell them who I was, wow. that I had social media, that I like. Well, I guess they assumed I like rocks and crystals. But I hope I'm getting that to how did focus they know? The people. I love Kumbaba so much. This would be a bit big on a necklace, though. I mean, guys, this is a... Uh, <laughs> it's like a crystal ball. Is a crystal ball, literally. Oh, my God. Here, let me hold it in my hand. Oh, <laughs> oh, it's so pretty. That is amazing. Oh, it's heavy. How how heavy do you think this is? A I couple pounds? Maybe two, two and a half pounds? Where's your scale? We're going to test my calibrations. Fluid ounces? What the hell is fluid ounces for? You got you to change the unit. Milliliters? How does it measure? It's a scale. Grams. Um, Okay, I can deal with grams. No, I, I grams. want pounds. I can convert grams to pounds. It will literally do that for you. Okay, it's 843 grams. <laughs> oh it's 454 God. grams to a pound. So it's about 1.8 pounds. Okay. Here, we'll have it unit me back to pounds. One pound, 14 ounces. Yeah, okay. About 1.8 pounds. You know what they about say about Americans who are good at metric systems. Yeah, I must be an engineer. Or. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely not that. <laughs> I'd be richer. Oh my gosh. I'm so happy with this. I'm so happy with this whole thing. I'm way, way happier than I thought. I thought this was going to be good. I did not think it was going to be this good. This is everything I got all together, as well as a few close-ups of my favorites. If it wasn't already obvious enough, I absolutely think this was worth the $300 price tag. I think this box might be sold out right now, but if you want to check out other stuff from this shop, it's Autumn Eclipse Jewelry on Etsy. Sarah, if you're watching this, you absolutely nailed it. This was so amazing. I love, love, loved everything in here. It was just so good. To all you other Rock Gremlins out there, let me know if you think it was worth the money in the comments. Thank you very much for watching and happy holidays.